Happy Father's Day, folks. This, welcome back to Seriously Kind Sundays, a journey through kindness brought to you by the Family Dump Truck Company. I'm Abby. I'm Riley. And welcome back to episode 33. Today, we made some special things for our dad. Like, I made a scavenger hut, and Riley made a card. And we even got dad a nice little stone with a B on it that says, Be Kind. You might not see it, but our sideboard says, um, Dad uh, carved Be Kind into both sides. Today is Father's Day, and I hope you did something very nice for your dad. Come on, Dad. Hi, Dad. Welcome to the show. Hello. Ha Happy Father's Day. Oh, fist pump. Look at that. Can I get a fist pump here, too? Father's Day is a day to honor our dads and make something kind for them. Like I did a card and a shrinky dig. If you don't know what a shrinky dig is, it's uh, like... It starts out big and then you like... Um, um, cook it on the stove and the only marker you can use is Sharpie and you can actually watch um, it shrink down on in the oven and it's really really fascinating dad do you want to show them the shrinky dink oh, i think i'd like to say hello to everybody Jeez, we haven't talked on the on the show here in quite a while um you want, you want to hold that for me for a second all right i'm gonna i'm gonna put the no i got it i got everything put the mic right there hi friends welcome back family dump truck channel seriously kind sundays a journey through kindness episode 33 33 it's been a while since we've done a show, hasn't it? Yeah. We're going to probably talk about that in future videos, why it's been so long. There's a specific reason. Uh, we're not going to get into that here today, but certainly we felt that Father's Day was a great day to be able to do another video. We've had a lot of really great things going on. Uh, business has been fantastic. Uh, market niche we've been getting into has been gravel driveways. We've done a couple gravel driveways. Uh, which I uh, really enjoy doing. What's going on, dude? What? You okay? Yeah. Okay. Like this thing. Boy, you want to make sure it doesn't sting you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we've had a lot going on on the home front. Uh, we had a, a big drainage project that we undertook here at the house that we hired a local company, A&W Sanitation and Excavation here in Guilford, Connecticut. What one? Yes, it does. Uh, the Larkins family. Phenomenal people. Highly recommend them locally. Um, thank you to Andrew, Mark, and all the guys. Uh, big, uh, big project here at the house. Maybe we'll talk about that in some future videos. But today's Father's Day. And I gotta tell you, I couldn't be any more proud of my two kids. These guys are the best. Daddy, which is, show them the yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna talk about some of that stuff. Which is one of the biggest reasons why my wife Laura and I decided to start the family dump truck company. It's for these guys. What are some of the things that you guys have learned along the way? No, I'm going to leave the mic right here. You can stay, sit up on the seat. You're okay, sit up. But more than that, what else have you guys learned? Well, how to start a business. Yeah, what? How to talk to people? Yeah? Have a, a business sense? Learning what? R -r 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 Re Responsibilities. Responsibility, that's right. How about being on time? Yes, yes. And Always be five minutes early. Dead. What? And being also, um, starts with an R. Respectful? Yes! Yeah, I think that is fantastic. What have you guys learned about tools and equipment? Oh, some Dad. tools are, um, Dad. safe, like a hammer and, um, a screwdriver if yeah. someone's watching you. Some tools are not safe. A chainsaw. Like a chainsaw. A or, splitter, a tractor, yes. a Kubota. I yep. know how to drive a Kubota with Dad. Um, a hammer is not like, it's a little bit dangerous, but not that. It's a hand tool, yeah. right? Yeah. So we did a video last year where we showed all the different saws for being able to try and oh, cut that log we had, right? Oh, yeah. 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 That was huge. It was. It was big. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. Can you show them all these? Yeah, we will. Yeah. Yes, sir. No, hold on. We'll let Riley talk for a minute. Ramble and Riley. You guys remember Ramble and Riley? What does he do? Ramble on. <laughs> so, Dad, when are I we going to do tools are not toys? 
Uh, we've talked about that uh, at many lengths, and one of the re it's been tough doing videos. We've had a lot going on. Uh, springtime is very busy here at the house, trying to get the property in shape, uh, mulching. The big project that we just had here, uh, serving our customers, uh, certainly our, our normal professional lives, the kids with school. Uh, Riley, oh, I don't think everybody knows you're into drums now. Yep. Yeah, Riley's big into drums. He's taking drum lessons. Abigail is uh, almost two years here now on the piano. I just did my piano recital. Yeah, she's had a piano recital. Sit up. Thank you very much. Sit up square. Yeah, thank you very much. You yes, sir. Um, want to tell them um, sure, then you can. about... I'm going to. Next year about um, off the patio. Oh, well, that'll be something. We'll talk about that in future videos. Okay. All right. Have you guys had a lot of fun? Yeah. yeah. Well, Steve, we've had fun giving these to you, and we can look at them. Well, yeah, we're going to talk about that in just a second. Oh, but Dad, hold on. Dad, um, what? I, I like how they um, did like um, that thing, like not B, um, B, E. I like it. was like a B, E. E, B, like a like a B. B. Actual B. Uh, yeah. Like the bumblebee, then pine. Sit up, please. I I, I kind of like that. Thank you. <laughs> I think that's great. These guys have gotten so much out of what we've done here, uh, with uh, with different things here on the on the home front. I'm not gonna call it a homestead because it's not a homestead, but on the home front, right? Uh, what do we have? Some uh, we had a lot of time in what the shop. Yep. learning how to use some different power tools and hand tools yep. drill press that's a great video to check out with your kids uh the hand sander dad yeah i think the most dangerous tool that we've had so far i think it would be a splitter a chainsaw i mean a husqvarna chainsaw well husk husk yeah husqvarna is a type of chainsaw and then we also have one that begins with an s steel steel, steel that's right yep it's not spelled s T-E-A-L and Right, because that would be for stealing. S-T-H-I-H-L. No, I-H-L. I-H-L. Yeah, I-H-L. Yeah. Yeah. So let's talk about Father's Day. Yeah. All right. So first of all, very happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. And uh, granddads. And granddads, uncles, they're called, they're called cousins, anyone that's a father type figure. They're right? called granddads because they're grand. Yeah, because they're grand. I think we got grandpa coming here today too, right? Yeah. What are we gonna do? Some barbecue? Yeah. yeah. All right, so I wanna share some stuff that the kids did for me for Father's Day, because this stuff is really, really cool. First, we're gonna we're gonna share the first one here. This here was a B. All right, I think everybody could probably see this. It's a B and it says B kind with a B. Kind of like what we have up here. Step with an extra E. On the sideboards, right? With just an extra E. Yeah. Because that's a big part of what we're trying to teach our kids. So we're going to put that in there so it doesn't fall and break. How about the shrinky dick? Yeah, we're going to do the shrinky dick. Next. So Riley made this with his class, right? It's called a shrinky dink, okay? And he he wrote, I love you, Dad. And he <laughs> drew a picture of a dump truck. Dump, what is it? Topsoil? Mulch? What is it? No, Dad. It's actually, um, it's actually the dump body. Off. Yeah. But but it's tipping something out of it, right? Are we dumping are we dumping some material? Uh, yeah. Okay, sit up. So Riley made this in school, and then his teacher uh, took it home, and uh, she did you know the, the finalization of it, where um, uh, warmed it up to temperature and, and shrunk it. And uh, this is great. I'm gonna keep this with me in the truck because uh, this is uh, this is what keeps we also me going. Gave him a giant Here, we're gonna let. Yeah, I got a massive Yeti cooler, which is a wine bottle for um, wow. nice vacation. What? Hold on a second. Him an acid. What I, you... over, I overheard you talking. What do you know about wine? No, I overheard you talking. Do you serve cheese with that wine? No. Either. Is that? Hold on a second. Is that what we're gonna? Maybe. Ah, oh, you know what? I got it. That's what we're gonna do. When she wines, we're gonna take her wines and put them inside the Yeti cooler. Mama, you want to get the Yeti cooler? We could take some of Abigail's wines and put it inside there. We could see how many of Abigail and Riley's wines we could put inside the Yeti cooler. That's hilarious. Yeah, probably not that many because sometimes your wines are really big. 
I'm only kidding. But yes, we could put it, it's tall enough where you could put a couple bottles of wine in there. Yeah, do the card. See the card. Yeah, we're gonna yeah, we're gonna do the card first. So Riley made me this card. This, this this card is actually very, very touching. He made a hand card, a handmade card that says, Happy Father's Day, Dad. And he's got be kind on here, and he's got a picture of the uh, of the Kubota with the front end loader with mulch in it. Um, picture of the sideboard, be kind. But here, here, here's what really touched my heart, right? I'm gonna read this. It says, Dad, you are the best dad ever. And my favorite memory was doing seriously kind Sundays and stacking firewood with you. He's got some pictures over here of trees and a splitter. This is awesome stuff. This is really, really great. And uh, if for nothing more than spending time with my with with my two kids and teaching them about uh, some of these some of these core values, where else are they going to learn this stuff? Nowhere. It's my job to teach them. It's my wife's job to teach them. But well, you guys are having a lot of fun. Yep. Brian, where are your two eyeballs? Mom. Mom. <laughs> so the next thing that we have here, so I'm going to put this in the back of the truck. I love this. This was awesome. It's like one of the best presents I could get. I didn't need a Yeti cooler. The Yeti cooler is a bonus. So, so the kids come up to me this morning and just completely bamboozle me uh, early on in the morning. You, you did. Can you sit on that properly? Thanks. Yeah. So they gave me a scavenger hunt to try and come downstairs this morning and try and find what, breakfast? Yeah. So there's a place that leads to one floor to another. If you can find it, you will find your detony. Not <laughs> destiny, detony. <laughs> Did you almost snort? Who almost snorted? <laughs> yeah, sit up. <laughs> sit up. All right. I was right in the car. Yeah. Uh, number two. See, you ended somewhere, so look straight and you'll find what you're looking for. I'll give you a clue. You pass a pig <laughs> if you're going the right way. Now, we have a guinea pig in the house. Abigail has a guinea pig named Rosie, which you guys have seen before, but I had no idea that she was talking about the guinea pig. I come downstairs this morning, I'm looking for Wilbur, right? I'm looking for a big pig. I didn't find it. Three. If you're hungry for a buffet, <laughs> how many of you guys want a buffet? <laughs> right? You know where to look. Do did did I find a buffet or a buffet? Buffet. <laughs> yes, a buffet. Hope you had fun, Dad, on this special riddle hunt. This is great stuff. Are you guys having a great day? Yes, yeah. We went out for a nice bike ride out at Ham and Asset. Yep. And we're gonna play laser tag. Yeah, we got laser tag. We did laser ring tag toss, yesterday. And have it a was, few beers. It's called ladder toss tag. Oh, ladder toss. Did, okay. We did laser tag yesterday. It was so fun. Right, right. Look at your audience, please. Yeah, it's like it's like capture the flag, but everyone's wearing this thingy. It's a triangle, and each side counts as alive. Yep. And there's like, like this little ball. If it goes out, then you lose your life, and then the thingy um. It vibrates on you, and and then if if it goes womp womp womp, you have to sit um out in the first person um to get the flag yeah, wins. Yeah, and if your whole team gets out, then the other team wins. Who thinks that on our new series of episodes coming up this year, that we should have a hook, and when someone just starts like rambling or just talking about all kinds of nonsense, you get the hook, and you just right off the stage. Maybe it doesn't have to be a hook, but it could be like a rake. It could be like a yard rake. A really? Like Rye Rye, what's your favorite part of the dump truck? He's got to really think about this. The dump body. You want to get the key and start the truck and we'll sign off? Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Wait, what? My I think you probably part, figure. My what's your favorite part? part? Truck is Let's see. My a cup holder that I can put pencils in. It, it's a special one. It's um. Uh, Not yet though. It's yeah. like a it's, yeah. a it's a husky one. It's red and black. I can put pencils on the outside. Yeah. Water bottle inside. Because it's the family dump truck. What do we do inside this truck? We what? Okay. We laugh. We learn. We live. We sing. We work. We learn a lot of stuff. Why are you taking your shoe off? 
On the show? Seriously? Sorry. Oh wait, that's right. I'm sorry. It's seriously stinky Sundays. <laughs> sorry. Okay. All right. Who's gonna sign off? Me. Me. Okay. I think Riley should sign off. Okay. Because you typically do your what? He kind of love others, and then he signs off as a goofy name. All right. Well, I think he should sign off first, then he could start the truck like he's gonna drive off into the sunset. Oh yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's it. Rai Rai, come on up here. No, you're not doing a dump body. Rai Rai, come on up here. What do you want to tell everybody? Be kind of love others. I'm out. You're out? That's it? Done? Happy Father's Day. Yeah, happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. Very big happy Father's Day to all of our friends, all of our family, all the people that support us. We are going to have more videos coming up. I can promise you that. And we're going to share a little bit about why uh, why we haven't done some videos here over the course of the last couple of months. So we're gonna, we're gonna wait a little bit longer on that and then we're gonna talk about that a little bit. But I hope everybody has an absolutely fantastic weekend. This is a picture perfect day here today in Connecticut. Um, I'm really proud of you guys. I love you guys. Hugs. Yeah, big hugs. All right, bye friends. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day, bye. bye.